WTFNN. Headline news update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien, coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 1 p.m. Eastern time on Wednesday, three hours left to go in the trading day. And we got markets in negative territory. Dow Jones right now, negative 36 points, trading at 26,617. We've got the NASDAQ right now, negative 13, trading at 81.06, and S&Ps, negative by seven, trading at 29.30. Dollar index, positive 385 ticks, trading at 97,705. Got gold up $4 at 127780 notes and bonds higher price lower yield 10 year note up 12 ticks 12316 30 year bond up 26 ticks almost a full point 14710 start things off let's take a look at the indices the futures markets we'll start it off with the Dow 30 so we've had a little bit of a slide to negative territory from early this morning 8 a.m. we make highs in the Dow of 26691 as we speak approaching the intraday low that we we had just after the opening bell, you have the Dow trading 26,605. NASDAQ 100 making session lows as we speak, 78.09. Even as we approach 11 a.m., we're up there at 78.45. So you're talking about almost a half a percent we've pulled back in the last two hours. S&P. We were up here this morning, 11 a.m. of 29.39. We're now approaching 10 S&P points below that level. Just even in the last 10 minutes, we've traded about four or five points to the negative side in those futures. Crude oil. We got EIA numbers this morning at 10.30. We saw a build of 5 million plus barrels. The estimate was only for a build of about a million barrels. You saw oil trade from $66.20. We trade under the 66 level. You're sitting at $65.83 currently, June crude. And gold catching a bid as we have gold trading up 12.77, briefly above that 12.80 price point. Term Excuse me, in terms of what else you have happening out there, it is still earning season. Some of them out there, as we look, we'll, we'll talk about this one real quick. PG&E, the news story breaks this morning that maybe Berkshire Hathaway is going to be buying PG&E. Quite a spike up to 28.58. Berkshire comes out and says, nope, fake news not happening. Still, though, on just the, the hint of that, you're trading up 6%. You got Boeing. No more 2019 forecast for Boeing, and the market says, guess what? We already knew that was coming. We're up 1.3%, and the big one today, how about Tesla? Coming out with their earnings after the bell. Tesla right now down about a half a percent, $262. Stay tuned, folks. Steve Rhodes coming up right now with the Trader's Edge. Have a great Wednesday.